my dear friends viewers and subscribers today i am discussing a medical condition which is equally important for youngers and elders i am not a doctor or a medical professional so the contents of this video are just based on general information and not to be taken as a medical advice the viewers must contact their doctors for any advice this is a was subject and i will just try to discuss in a very brief manner this is known as sarcopenia sarcopenia is comparatively a new topic and many people are not familiar with this word or with this disease sarcopenia has been defined as an age related disease or condition mainly because of the loss of muscle mass and strength in 1989 dr irwin rosenberg propose this term from greek word sarx means flesh and penia means loss so he named it sarcopenia to describe this age related decrease of muscle mass this medical condition results in decrease of life span imbalance and numerous medical issues now let us discuss importance of muscle mass there are numerous benefits of muscle mass such as a strong immune system delaying age related muscle loss support to joints control of body fat building stamina protection against obesity diabetes and cardiovascular disease keeping your metabolism and hormone levels functioning at higher profiles it also prevents falls and illnesses less muscle means greater weakness and less mobility though both of which may increase your risk of falls and fractures a 2015 report from the american society for bone and mineral research found that people with sarcopenia had 2 3 times more risk of having a low trauma fracture from a fall such as a broken hip collarbone leg arm or wrist so now the symptoms of sarcopenia the main symptoms of sarcopenia are overall weaknesses low level of balance and falling muscle weakness feeling slow walking speed a weakened grip lower stamina low strength and endurance leading to decreased functional performance it affects overall ability to perform daily tasks lower physical activity levels also further contribute to muscle shrinkage tiring faster than usual and less inclined to take part in physical activities are also the symptoms non intentional weight loss also can be a symptom and must be discussed with doctor if you feel any of such symptoms do discuss with your doctors for a test for sarcopenia now we will discuss causes of sarcopenia if we go into technical details there are many proposed causes and it is likely the result of multiple interacting factors in simple words various researches have shown that immobility dramatically increases the rate of muscle loss even in younger people the factors that can increase rate of progression can be lower nutrient intake environmental influences low birth weight inflammation and low physical activity now decline of muscle mass although it is considered as an age related condition but the decline of muscle mass starts around the age 30 to 40 as per various researches age related muscle loss begins at age 30 or even earlier at age 25 physically inactive people can lose as much as 3% to 5% of their muscle mass each decade after age 30 and may lose up to 50% at age 80 bed rest is the worst thing which results in loss of muscle mass now let us discuss tips to decrease chances of sarcopenia so far there are no approved medications for sarcopenia however the following tips can be considered as per various researches but you must contact your doctor for 
any medical advice. The primary treatment for sarcopenia is exercise, specifically resistance training or strength training. These activities increase muscle strength and endurance using weights, etc. The strongest way to fight sarcopenia is to keep your muscles active. As per famous saying, use it or lose it. Eating enough calories and high quality protein can slow down the rate of muscle loss. Omega-3 fatty acids and creatine supplements may also help fight sarcopenia. Food rich in calcium and vitamin D can help muscle and bone health. Calcium rich foods include dairy products like milk, cheese, yogurt, leafy green vegetables such as broccoli and spinach, calcium added foods such as orange juice and cereals and fish such as sardines and salmon. Muscle building foods for gaining lean muscle can be helpful like eggs, vitamin B, salmon, chicken breast, Greek yogurt, tuna, lean beef, shrimps and beans. Other nutrients such as carnitine compounds and the amino acid glutamine have biological effects that may be beneficial in promoting healthy muscle mass. Leucine amino acids are also considered helpful, which are available in leafy green vegetables, beans and eggs, etc. Hormone balance is very important to avoid this condition. The hormone levels should be got checked periodically to ascertain the position of your hormone levels. Anti-inflammatory diet helps to handle this medical condition. In addition to all, proper sleep is also very important for the healthy body. Now, final takeaway. I would like to mention some points as a final takeaway from this video clip. The medical experts are of the view that it is preventable and reversible, which is a silver lining. There may be many factors causing sarcopenia as the subject is under research and all the causes may not be fully discovered till now or might not be in our control. However, as per various researches and medical advices, there are two factors which are totally in an individual's control to stop, reverse or manage this serious medical condition. So first is exercise or activity. A strength training or weight training is an excellent way to build muscle mass. Cardio is very important. Aerobic exercises, jogging or dancing supports muscle growth and slows age-related muscle loss. Going up and down stairs, running, cycling and climbing, all are great exercises and can increase muscle mass. Research from the Center for Healthy Aging and Department of Biomedical Sciences of the University of Copenhagen in Denmark revealed that a young man who is immobilized for two weeks loses muscular strength in his leg equivalent to aging by 40 or 50 years. This is very, very important to note. The 10,000 steps walking can also be considered keeping in view your medical conditions and advice of doctor. Stay active as much as possible. Take care of elders in keeping them active. Don't let them confine to bed. It can be very dangerous for them. So simply activity is the key word. Second, diet. Diet plays a vital role in leading a healthy long life. To gain and maintain muscle mass, you need good nutrition. We need enough nutrient dense calories and protein for our body to build, repair and maintain muscle mass. The high protein foods include beef, poultry, fish, eggs, beans and nuts, etc. It is best to avoid Processed food, some researchers claim that 20 to 30 grams of protein should be taken with every meal. Carbohydrates are also required to fuel your muscles, which may be considered up to 50% of your 
daily calories intake. The adequate intake of fat, vitamins and minerals are also important for building muscles. My dear friends, that's all for today. We will meet soon with some other topic of interest. My sole intention is to discuss the topics relating to healthy living, successful and happy life. I hope you have watched all my videos on YouTube. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel and favor me with your comments or observations, which will help me to improve my future videos. Thank you once again.